Maybe today, Sonny, the more appropriate thing would come from the Horn Frog legend Dutch Meyer. He said, fight him till hell freezes over and then fight him on the ice. Your boys ready to fight today against Michigan? Yeah, yeah, for sure. We're excited. It's been a heck of a week here uh, in Phoenix. Uh, Verbo has been awesome. The Fiesta Bowl has been incredible. But now it's time to play. So our, our guys are excited and ready. You can see the excitement in the room last night. So we're ready to tee it up today and see what happens. Hey, Coach, I don't know if you headbutted one of your guys or not, but <laughs> you, cut yourself shaking. you are awesome. Uh, this is obviously <laughs> this is obviously your first year uh, at TCU. Hey. Go ahead. I'm sorry. Go ahead, Coach. <laughs> I got, I got a six-year-old son, man. I mean, it's a, I got a different injury every day. Wow. <laughs> well, I had a swollen eye earlier in the week, so awesome. I look a lot better than I used to. Hey, well, I'm happy your six-year-old son is trying to treat this just like any other game. Hey, Dad, I don't care if you're in a college football playoff. I'm going to give you a yeah, white exactly. haymaker right above your eye with a black eye. But let's talk about your team. We chatted about it earlier. Five guys with bowl experience. This is your first year there. Obviously, Max Duggan is a dog. And on the offensive line, Steve Avia is a guy and Kendra Miller how have you been able to get them to buy in so quickly and now that this is the expectation I mean good luck sleeping for the next what 20 years now coach we're going to be here every single year right (laughs) (laughs) yeah yeah you know um, we got a lot of leadership on this team I mean that's been the biggest thing that that I've been really a little bit surprised by a bit excited by that's been the key to our season really we just got a lot of tough-minded guys a lot of guys that are unselfish really care about each other have provided tremendous leadership um you know, we had two contrasting games back to back. We had a big lead against Oklahoma at halftime, walked in the locker room, expected to find guys celebrating. Everybody was sitting down talking about the second half and, and how we needed to focus. A week later, we got a 17 point deficit, walked in the locker room and it was the same. And that's to me when I knew, hey, this, this team is pretty special because they handle success and failure the same way. Uh, they're consistent. They show up, they go to work and, and it's a tough minded group. Coach, uh, thanks for joining us. Desmond Howard, you know, when Pat asked you about the cut over your head, I thought you were going to give us uh, the Nick Saban response. Like, you should see the other guy. <laughs> you went the other direction. You blamed on your six-year-old son. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah, I respect that. When you look at Michigan's offensive line, this group won the Joe Moore Award as the best offensive line in the country. Um, what concerns do you have with your defense going up against Michigan's offensive line? Well, they're really good. I mean, they've won it back-to-back years, and and certainly that's how this Michigan team is built is up front. Uh, Both the offensive and defensive front are big and physical. They're well coached. Um, You know, they play with great technique. That's something that doesn't get talked about much. But these guys are technicians. They work well together. they got a lot of experience. So it's it's a really good group. You know, the thing that we have to do, and it's real simple, is we got to play really hard. we got to play physical. we got to play with a tough mindset. And then we have to do our job consistently, and that's hard to do when you got big people banging on you. And you look at the second half of games, Michigan's been outstanding in the second half. And I think what happens is their offensive and defensive fronts start to take over the game. So, you know, we're a more physical team than people think. I think sometimes people hear Big 12 and they think you're not physical. Um, you know, we're kind of an air raid style of offense. They think you're not physical. You know, this is a tough group. I mean, we're big up front, uh, particularly in our offensive line. Our guys are, are tough and we play a physical brand of football. Very experienced as well, at least in terms of number of games played up front. Sonny, wish you all the luck in the world. Thank you for spending time with us this morning. Yeah, thanks, guys. I appreciate you having me. And, again, thank you for what you guys do for college football, man. It's a, it's a fun, to, fun to watch it. Going to full guard with that six-year-old next time. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> got, to, got to cover up. Keep the hands, <laughs> keep the hands, <laughs> keep the hands high, Sonny. <laughs> Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.